Hi everyone, it's me Robert here and this video is the first episode of a multi-part YouTube series where I'm going to show you how to build a full stack NFT marketplace with or without lazy minting. If you're wondering what's lazy minting and why you actually would need it, well, it's an approach to mint and sell NFTs with literally no gas fees for the NFT creator or seller. In this first video, I'll show you a live demo of the NFT marketplace and give you an overview of the technologies we are using to build it. If you think that sounds interesting, make sure that you don't miss out on any episode and click the subscribe button below. Now let's jump right into it! Okay, here in the foreground window you can see our NFT marketplace and in the background window there is my development environment which is Visual Studio Code. I've created one NFT yet and we are going to create another one together right now by clicking on the create and sell your NFT button. Here we can enter a name of the NFT, a short description and the price in Ether. With the order type, we choose if we want to lazy mint the NFT, which is gas free, or if we want to mint the NFT directly on the blockchain. For this demo, we choose lazy minting with ARP 712. Now we can upload an image for our NFT. Then we click create and sell. This opens the MetaMask browser, which shows us the structured data of our NFT, which we need to sign. Once the data is signed, we get redirected back to our page, My NFTs, where we can see a new NFT. In order to demonstrate how another user can buy this NFT, I switch to another account in MetaMask. Now you can see that the label of the button of our NFT has changed to buy. We click on it. This opens the MetaMask browser with the buyer account again and the buyer can see the NFT price. And here he can confirm the purchase. Now the NFT was minted on the blockchain and the label of the button changed to sell. By clicking on the sell button, the buyer can sell his NFT again. Okay, so what are actually the technologies we are using to build this marketplace? In my development environment, I run WSL2, which is the Windows subsystem for Linux that allows us to run the Linux operating system Ubuntu on Windows. Visual Studio Code, this is the source code editor I use to write the whole source code. We use Next.js, which is a React.js production framework that enables us to write the front-end code, but also the API for the back-end. Tailwind is a CSS framework that supports us to develop a good-looking UI. The smart contracts we call with Solidity, which is the Ethereum programming language for smart contracts. We use Hardhat, which is an Ethereum development environment that supports us to write smart contracts and to deploy it to the blockchain. To implement lazy minting, we use AIP 712, which is an Ethereum improvement proposal for hashing and signing type structured data. Open Zeppelin is a good library to start off with smart contracts and ARP 712. We use MongoDB, which is a document oriented database to store off chain data like signatures of lazy minted NFTs. Finally, we make use of IPFS, the interplanetary file system, to immutably store our NFT images and metadata. If you like this content and you want to see more, please make sure that you click the like and the subscribe button below. Thanks for watching!